हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम नीरज शर्मा असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर बियानी ग्रुप ऑफ कॉलेजेस बिहाफ ऑफ गुरु के पी ओ आई एम प्रजेंटिंग ऑन अनदर टॉपिक विच इज कॉल्ड रजिस्टर्स इन कंप्यूटर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी शुड नो अबाउट द रजिस्टर वट इज रजिस्टर बेसिकली रजिस्टर इज अ कंपोनेंट विच इज वी आर यूजिंग फॉर ट्रांसफरिंग द डेटा एज वेल एज इंस्ट्रक्शन दैट वी कैन बी यूज बाय द सी पी यू इट मीन्स ए सेंट्रल प्रोसेसिंग यूनिट कैन बी एग्जीक्यूट और ट्रांसफर द डेटा और इन्फॉर्मेशन फ्रॉम वन कंपोनेंट टू अनदर कंपोनेंट यूजिंग ऑफ रजिस्टर्स वी कैन से दैट इट इज़ ए स्टोरेज एरिया विच इज कैन बी स्टोर टेम्परली द डेटा इन ए बफर एरिया Uh, for a particular time being so we can say that uh, it is a basically uh, the storage area we can cover inside the registers uh, we have different operations perform like fetching is another operation decode is another operation execution is another operation so these kind of operation we can perform uh, using of registers friends we discuss uh, what is register basically uh, after that we can uh, performing some operations on the registers uh, we have like uh, fetch fetch operation is a uh, different operation we can perform it uh, it is used for taking the basically instructions uh, which can be uh, fetching with the another instructions and uh, we can given by the user and stored in main memory so we can say that fetching is the process uh, by which we can uh, perform some operations or we can fetch the instruction from one component to another component secondly is called uh, decode decode means uh, the operation which we are using for interpreting uh, the instructions uh, we can say that uh, it means ki cpu is uh, will find out operation is to be performed on the instruction so and uh, the third operation is called execute operation execute means uh, produce the result and uh, after that stored in the memory friends after discussion on uh, uh, operations of register we can uh, furtherly we can uh, discuss about the type of register how many type of register are supported in computer organization so first of all we should be discuss about that memory address register is there memory buffer register is there uh, io address register is there uh, io buffer register is there and index register is there so we can discuss about the further uh, that uh, what these registers are can be uh, include uh, what kind of operations inside these registers friends uh, let's discuss with the type of register uh, memory address register is the first register we can use it uh, it hold the address of memory basically where we can cpu wants to read or uh, write the data means uh, in uh, case of uh, if we want to read or write the data using of cpu then on that time cpu will be include this type of register memory address register it will be explain uh, the address of location of uh, the particular uh, uh, register or maybe some data or instruction and where we ha we have the data or information second register is called memory buffer register in memory buffer register basically we hold the content of uh, data in memory it means we focus on or we emphasis on particular data that what kind of data we are using into the memory third type of register is called io register in io register basically we have the address of particular io devices it means we have lot of input and output devices so particular address can be explain or can be being explained by the uh, this type of register which is called io register friends uh, let's discuss about another type of register which is called accumulated register in accumulated register basically we store the in data or information or result which can we can produce after processing the in the system uh, we can say that when cpu generate uh, some particular results or after processing some data then on that time we can uh, accumulated register we can work or we can use it on that time index register is another type of register uh, a hardware element basically uh, we have a hold a number of uh, uh, numbers that can be added uh, into particular register and uh, we have uh, all the numbers into particular index means we have key and value pair so after that uh, if uh, some information or some data is going to be stored in particular uh, table so on that time uh, we can use uh, this type of register uh, we can search it the information or data by using of index register means index register is going to be uh, addressing some information uh, on particular area of memory and then it can be uh, retrieve the data or information from the memory and display it friends thanks for watching this video please uh, like comment and share and uh, don't forget to subscribe your youtube channel and visit your website gurukpa.com thank you so much thank you very much